everyone, today I'm going to show you how to export your photo from Lightroom into a JPEG, RAW file, or Photoshop file, or TIFF file, and how you can create presets to do that very quickly, and this will speed up your workflow. So this is how I do it. Um, you don't necessarily have to follow each technique here, but I'm going to show you how I do it, and that way you guys can follow along and pick and choose what you'd like to do. So here we've got Lightroom open, and I'm going to slide it right over so you see the desktop. And you can see I have this folder here called Create. This is where all my files go into and I export them to. They also open up into Adobe Bridge. All right, I'm gonna show you guys how to create some export presets. And first, let's take a look at how I have this set up. So go to File, Export, and under Tim's Creations, you can see I've got four different presets all set up. So let's take a look at, let's say this TIFF one here. You can see it's TIFF has changed. I've got to go into a specific folder, the create folder I created on the desktop. Also, I have it opening up into Adobe Bridge. So let's just start and set one up ourselves. So I'm going to close this down, close that, and let's say specific folder. We've already got that set up, and this is how you choose which folder you want it to go to. So let's say you have another folder on your desktop and you haven't named something else. You go to desktop, you find that folder, you click it and you click choose. So this one I've got there, create, that's the one we want it to go to. And you can change a whole bunch of other things here. Image format, I wanna to set to, let's go with JPEG, and let's go with quality 100%, and sharpening, you can do that. The image size, this would be great if you wanna do something for Facebook or you're always repeating the same size of image, you can set it all up here. And down here you can go to all metadata, that's what I like, or you can just say copyright only. And post-processing, so let's say you want to open it up in Photoshop, you can do that under right there, or in this case, open in another application, and we've got Adobe Bridge, so I'll show you how to find that. You go to Choose, Applications, Adobe Bridge, Adobe Bridge, Choose, and there you go, so you're all set up and now we can create a preset so let's go to add and you can select your folder you can either create a new one let's just put it into tim's creations here my own folder and name it sample and jpeg so now we have a sample one called jpeg i'm going to go to create there you go so now i've got this new preset in here and now we can use it so click that and export Okay, Adobe Bridge is opened up. There's our JPEG file right here. And let's close this down and let's check out the folder on our desktop. So let's go over here. There you go. There's the JPEG file right there as well. So we told it to send it to Adobe Bridge, open it up there, and send it to that folder we have on our desktop. So as you can see, there's many different options when you're exporting your photo from Lightroom, and you can create different presets depending on the settings you've set up.